Right, so as you can see, I've got the full MLS All-Star Silvers. Uh, to be fair, a lot of them originally was really, really hard to get, but they 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 really they hired the price ranges and they did they did perfect with the price ranges. To be fair, guys, basically they doubled the price ranges on the first change and then they added I think they added some a little bit more, which basically put them over the top. And most of them aren't extinct anymore. Uh, Finley was originally extinct. If everyone was extinct, I think in fact yeah, literally every single one of them was extinct. Uh, I think the only ones that are extinct now is that Gini is Janino at the right centre mid and now Zordes. Zordes is going to be extinct for... I don't even know how much he's going to have to go up to for him not to be extinct, but still. This team is the one I've mainly been looking forward to, to be honest, out of all the other teams. Just because it's silver, it's a little bit different to what I'm normally doing. So, I'm just going to get into a game and hopefully... It plays well, even though I'm probably going to be coming up against gold teams. So you got to bear that in mind, guys. If I get wrecked, then it's because, you know, it's not because I'm shit, okay? I think this guy might have a silver team as well. Oh, he does as well. Thank God for that. Oh, yes, I'm really happy about that. I'm so happy I'm coming up against the silver team with my silvers. He's good team this season, Al Alidor as well. This should be interesting. McCarty. No. Janino. He's got a rocket of a shot. He has a fucking rocket of a shot. His in-game shooting stats are ridiculous for a silver. Absolutely ridiculous. He's got like 92 shot power and like 90 long shots. Just absolutely ridiculous. Look at that. It's like an absolute missile. You ain't stopping that, bud. And Altidore goes and bangs that. Didn't expect him to score. So I didn't even say anything before. I wasn't like, oh no. Like, it was just out of nowhere. Hey, King, look at this! Hey, out of nowhere! Nah, 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 nah! <gasps> Fucking hell, man! Right, so that, that first game just. <laughs> it was just shit. It was just so shit, and it didn't give. Zod is any justice because I know how good he is because look I've used him myself I've used him before this team this squad builder and I used him in a fucking gold team against golds and then um, it was it was in a two striker formation though so that might be the problem here the, I don't think this formation is really suiting this team at all I'm gonna give it another go but I'm not I was looking forward to it but I should have known that this formation is just absolutely terrible in this game I hate this formation so much it, it's this and 4-3-3 with the cam is like two of the worst formations for me I just can't use them they just don't work for me but I'm gonna give it another go and hope for the best so yeah pray for me guys pray for me see what's in this guy 68 chemistry oh it looks more like a um, is that start is that like is that like a starter team I think this guy might have only just started ultimate team or something. But it should be a decent test for these players to be honest. Really? Fucking really? What is that? My keeper's not even attempted to save it. This keeper is so bad. Zod is making another beautiful run. Take it round the keeper. Come on. There we go. Finally, equalised. Zordes doing what he does best. Just absolutely wrecking the defence with his pace. He's, he's, it just makes him a perfect player with how tall he is, how fast he is, how strong he is. He's got four star skills. He's pretty agile as well. He's got like, I think he's got like 90 agility in game. So his in game stats are just ridiculous. He's even got four star weak, but that's it, boys. That's it, Zordes. That's it, Zordes. That's it, Zordes. Come on. I'm so happy now. Finally. 2-1 in the lead. Please don't get wrecked now, Lewis. Please. Oh, the guy fucking quit, man. 2-1. Gonna go into one last game. Even if the guy quits in this game or not, I'm, this is my last game. So yeah, let's just hope that the guy doesn't quit and that I can actually get a full game done. Let's go. Alright, this guy had a 4-0 all-star team. I'm not quite looking forward to playing against him. Oh, it's a non-rare team. It's not too bad, actually. 
non res against Team of the Season Silvers. Hopefully, it's not too much of a mismatch. Yeah, let's go. Janino. Janino. Jesus Christ. Janino. Holy shit. His long shots are on point. His long shots are just fucking incredible. What a strike that is. From a silver. From a silver. Look at that. We'll have a bit of that. It's a good run, Zordes. It's a good finish. Holy shit, didn't expect him to finish that with his left foot. That's a great finish. That's a really powerful finesse shot. It's a, it's a really nice finish. I'm really impressed with that. Zordes with the skills. Finish. There we go. 3-0. This is the Zordes I love. This is this this is the game. See, this is the game I love, where the game actually feels how it should. Like it feels smooth, and my team don't feel like they're absolute retard passing it along the ground at fucking a snail's pace. Do you know? Do you know what I mean? They're actually pinging passes, and it's fine. It's working. The game's working basically. It doesn't feel fucking broken. He just makes such powerful runs. Look at this. It's just easy for him. What is Bezler doing in front? What are you doing? What even is that? Why the fuck have you ran all the way up the pitch and blocked the keeper? That's it, Zardes. That's beautiful link-up play with Castillo. Finish. It's just too easy. It's just too easy for him. It's just a fucking way too easy for him. 4-0. Four, four <laughs> Let's go. And the guy quit at 45 minutes. Uh, pretty, I was destroying him pretty much. He just had better possession. But, yeah. It was just too easy. Right, so I'm going to name my favourite players out of this squad. First, well, first of all, this formation, don't ever use it with MLS Silvers. As much as I destroyed that guy in that game, and he played pretty well in the game before that, it's, it's really not the formation to go with MLS Silvers. If anything, go with a two-strike formation for Zardes. My favourite player in this team, without a doubt, is Zardes. He's just incredible. Um, the right centre mid, Janino, is just amazing. He's, his long shots are just on point. His long shots are just incredible. Phil Haber or Phil Haber. I don't know how to pronounce his name. That I just that's just what I call him. I, that might be completely wrong. But uh, he's also really good. Bezler is an absolute fucking tank. He's amazing. Bezler is like one of the best silver centre backs you can get your hands on. Gonzalez, pretty solid. Beltran is pretty solid. But my I, I don't like Castillo. He's just basically he's just pace. If you can get any pacey winger with decent dribbling, they're going to be better than Castillo pretty much. He can't shoot at all. His shooting is just terrible. Finlay, he's alright, but high, high work rates and free star skills, free star weak foot really is a massive pot off. And it really does let him down. McCarty is just terrible. It's as simple as that. He's terrible. Beasley cannot defend. He's fast. That's about it. If, if you're willing to pay 270k for a left back that's fast, but can't defend, then be my guest. Go ahead, go for it. Uh, and Usted is just terrible. <laughs> he's literally, he's honestly so fucking bad. But apart from that, this team was actually pretty good. Smash that thumbs up button, subscribe if you're new. Twitter's always down below in the description. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.